Hello there, I'm here with another tutorial for synthetic programming and today we are going to be remaking our Matrix CMD tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to teach you how to make a CMD matrix file on your computer. Use it to impress your friends, your family. It's pretty intense. I like to leave it up as a screensaver sometimes. So the first thing you're going to do is head down and open up a new notepad document. This notepad document is going to be where we type all of our code. So start off with the beginning statement for a batch file at echo off. Under that, mode 1000. This is going to decide our screen size. It's going to make it a pretty large window. Under that, simply pause it. Here, it'll ask us to input a key to start the program. This enables the program to not auto run at startup. Instead, we have to tell it to run. Under that, we're going to do colon A, and under that, go to, all one word, A. What this does is it makes a little door up here. Little door is A, and it comes through that little colon. When you say go to A, it goes up to A and repeats whatever code we put between A and go to A. So this is an infinite loop. It'll keep going until we tell it to stop. And in this case, we're not going to tell it to stop. After this, we write echo. Now, if you know anything about batch coding, you know that at echo off at the top is how we start off our batch file. But echo itself is how we make the program say something. Now, under echo, we're going to make it say a random number. So percent random percent is the syntax for making a random number show up. And we want to make a whole bunch of random numbers show up. So I like to hit control C and control V to copy it so that we have a second random number and then a third and then a fourth and then hold it down. You want to hold it down for a while just to make sure that you get about 900 columns you want a lot of random values to be shown. Now after that you have to go up here back to the mode 1000, make an extra line and set it to whatever color you wish. In this case we are making a matrix batch file so we're going to want to make it green. The code for that is color 0A. That's going to make it a nice shade of green and make it look just like the matrix. Now, after that, go up to File, Save As, sorry about that, and save it to the desktop. Save it as matrix.bat, or whatever you want to call it for that matter, and save it to all files. Hit Save, and it should show up right there. Oh, look at that. I spelled matrix wrong. That's the intelligence for you. Once you start up this program, it opens up our big window. And it says, press any key to continue. Once you hit that any key, it starts our matrix file. And you can see all those beautiful green colors going down pretty fast. You know, sometimes I like to space out and look at that. This thing, it looks sort of like green fire. And, and it just amazes me, you know, the, the power of a computer just to stare into this and watch all these bits moving back and forth. So, I hope you enjoyed. Rate, comment, subscribe, and please leave us a like. It really helps us out. Share this video with your friends. Throw it into uh, programming communities. Share it on Facebook. Whatever you can do. Thanks so much. I'm Ethan with Synthetic Programming, and we'll see you again soon.